And today's science file. Let's... Can you make things that sink float? You'll need some cups, some water, some eggs, and some salt. Holy crap, he's got a gun! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> this is up one, two, three clear glasses. Now, you could get yourself more glasses than that, but, you know, like the tea party, they'd be useless. <laughs> the tea party is useless! <laughs> okay, you're gonna fill these three glasses with 250 milliliters of water. Here we go! Now grab yourself three eggs. Oh. Okay, grab yourself two eggs. Okay, you're gonna take your first egg and you're gonna drop it in the water. Fail. Okay, now get yourself some salt and mix in four teaspoons into the water. Egg, and you're gonna drop this egg in the salt water. Here we go! Egg goes away! <laughs> okay, now get yourself some salt and mix in four teaspoons into the water. Now pour some of the salt water into a measuring cup and you're gonna drop this egg in the salt water. And now slowly and carefully add some fresh water and water! The egg just sits there, right in the middle. It doesn't sink or float. Why do eggs either sink, float, or, well, sit somewhere in the middle? Well, don't look at me. Take a closer look. this. <laughs> when you drop a raw egg into fresh water, the egg doesn't displace enough water, making the egg more dense than the water around it. This creates unbalanced forces, which sends the egg to the bottom of its container. Density is the amount of mass something has per volume, and when you add more mass to the same volume, you can change the density. When you add 4 teaspoons of salt to 250 milliliters of water and stir, the salt crystals break down into molecules and fill in the holes in between the water molecules. The solution now has more mass in the same space, or volume, which changes the density of the water. When you add an egg to the salt water, you displace the same amount of water, but this time the space has more molecules in it, so the egg becomes less dense than the salt water around it. When you slowly add fresh water to the salt water, the less dense fresh water floats on top of the more dense salt water, and you create a density column of water. The egg sinks through the less dense fresh water and floats in the more dense salt water. To make anything that doesn't float, you just have to increase or lower the density of the liquid you want the object to float in. So now you know how to float objects that don't float. You know, making an egg float right in the middle is why science